Welcome to Paris. Welcome to the spring. Welcome to my April vlog. Here's when I entered the chapel and they let me enter the very VIP area. <laughs> that is where the relic is. And that's a boon from Mary Magdalene. It's her only relic in Paris. And I felt really cool <laughs> being there. I've also been witnessing spring wherever I went and that's a little bit what you're witnessing right now I hope you also enjoyed wherever you were on the planet the flowers, the light changing, the temperature changing here's a bit of the sunset light from my flat and I'm in love with it, just feeling very connected present, grateful. So here's a bit of Montmartre when I'm going up to the hill to see the horizon and zoom out from my life, get some distance, some detachment and that helps me to reassess, pose, have a break before I come down again And there we go. Where will the month take you? Where will the next month take you? I love those reflections. Selecting what to focus on, what to create, what to consume, and just witnessing life on a smaller scale than the whole year's resolution. For April, I had a lot of plans and even though I didn't follow everything, I took care of myself, I took care of my health and I'm still on that journey and life flowering, the spring starting, all of those movements, the reopening of the country, all of it benefits my growth, it helps me to consider the time day after day week after week, creating a routine, witnessing others' routine take shape, discussing, preparing the life after the virus. And I've been coming here to this location every week to do my classes for driving. So it's been wonderful because that's also where my dad lives. So it takes me out of the city. I take the train. I see my family, I drive, and I connect with nature, looking for my own horizon, creating the long-term plan, and appreciating the right now. I hope you enjoy this vlog and that you're discovering Paris in a new light and like and subscribe and see you next